Hi, I'm Lee Tesler from Design World Magazine. We're here with Frank Moisio from Texas Instruments. Frank is going to tell us a little bit about DLP technology and kind of an interesting application for it. Frank, I think most people when they think of DLP, um, they think of projection TV and stuff like that. That's not at all what you're doing though here. Um, tell us a little bit about the um, heads-up displays that you have in mind for this technology. Right. So. Uh, we'll get into that. Um, if you're not familiar with DLP, uh, today DLP is in about eight, more than eight out of every ten movie theaters with a chip that looks something like this. Uh, this is a digital cinema chip. So we play in the digital cinema market. We also play in the conference room uh, market and in the home entertainment market. And uh, we have about five out of ten of those products are in DLP technology. What we've done is we've taken our cinema technology chip and we've shrunk it down to a, a chip that's about this size. This is called our DLP Pico uh, product, uh, and it's, there's many different of these types of products that go into many different applications. Uh, so for example, mobile smart TV, ambient lighting, uh, into smart home displays, into ultra mobile uh, displays. But what we're going to talk about here today is a new product category called aftermarket HUD. Interesting. And uh, my understanding of that technology is that you've gotten the HUD technology small enough that it can just be a, the size of a package of cigarettes and mount on your in your visor. That's correct. Uh, so this, what we're going to share with you is a product that just goes on top of your uh, dashboard, uh, and it's a very very small profile, and we're able to accomplish that because of the size of the chip reduction. And then we're able to allow uh, head-up display opportunity so that you can actually see navigation information as it's in the field of your uh, view of your driving. Uh, so you're able to see that uh, clearly and easily uh, with this product. Okay. This uh, tiny projector you have here, um, that's not really a consumer product. It's, it's a demonstration. There are going to be products like that on the market, correct? That's correct. What we're going to see right now is a demonstration of a product, and then in 2016 we'll see some additional products come to market uh, in, the, in the $200 to $300 price range. Okay, and just so we're clear, uh, we're demonstrating this on a piece of glass here, but it can be used on any kind of um, uh, dashboard and in, on any kind of uh, glass, correct? Uh, that's correct. This this particular product has what is a, a, a combiner as part of that product. Uh, so uh, the, the image that you'll see actually appears on that combiner. Uh, and so it can be used with any any kind of uh, dashboard in any, any kind of car. Great. 